I know this sounds a little sadistic, but episode seven where Scylla and Rael are reunited, that was a really, really difficult scene for us to shoot. But we learned a lot from each other. It bonded us more deeply. I don't understand. This is all you need to know. I love you, Rael. And I would never do anything to hurt you. Please believe me. I believe you. It, it was really interesting to sort of create a scenario where you truly feel like you want something and just be able to sort of hold each other afterwards and, and know that, you know, that was, uh, that was an emotion or a situation that we shared and we got through it. So it, it left us with, um, with a, a stronger connection than we had prior to, to shooting that scene. It really changed the way that I look at her and, um, you know, how much I, I value her presence uh, in what she does, in in her craft and her dedication, and um, it truly was heartbreaking. You know, when they pulled me out of that scene, um, I was sitting in the hallway, and uh, they continued playing out the rest of the scene, and I just had to listen to her screaming and crying for me and yelling for me, and it just I broke down in the hallway. <laughs> they had to keep checking on us because we kept shaking and crying and holding each other in between the takes because, you know, it's just a very emotionally demanding scene, but um, I'm very proud of her, and uh, I just, it, it was, I really just marveled, you know, watching, watching her on screen. It's She's incredible. So that I'd say was, um, it's, that's been a top thing for it and grow. It's just the rail and Scylla relationship. It's, it's taught me a lot about myself and, um, about acting. Yeah. Something we always speak to is, and, and we're always working on is, is trying not to take home your emotional trauma with you because when you're feeling these things, your, your body can't differentiate between actual trauma going on in your life and, and, you know, pretending. So, you know, there's a very fine line between not taking home that stress and that, that heaviness and pressure, um, because it can wreak havoc <laughs> in your personal life. And I don't think that's something that people talk about often enough, but it's something that actors, uh, face as a, as a challenge very often people who are very dedicated to their work, you know, it's, it's quite easy to take home the stress because your body can't understand that the situation wasn't real because it felt real at the time to your body, you know? So yeah, it's, it's, it's very interesting. And, um, it's, it was great practice and a, a great challenge for us to sort of, you know, hug it out afterwards and sort of shake it off and, you know, maybe do something a little bit more lighthearted to sort of separate our moments, you know, from bleeding into one another. <laughs>